Hi everyone, welcome back to another flight from STG. Uh, this time we're going to fly from Manchester's uh, airport, which is Echo Golf Charlie Charlie, into EHAM, which is Echo Hotel Alpha Mike, in Sip Schiphol, Amsterdam. Okay, so it will be a short flight, but we're going to try to do it uh using pilot to atc because i think as you recall atc in fs2020 is still not working okay so here we are uh, we have created uh, a flight plan in simbrief i don't want to go into detail on how to create the flight plan in simbrief i have another video showing that thing is down below in the descriptions and also here you can find the link to how to create a IFR flight plan uh, and also with the pilot to ATC. This is going to be using the team brief and then we're gonna open it in prepare, uh, preparing the chart in a graph and then take notes on every waypoint and create ourselves uh, the waypoint in pilot. Okay, so here's our flight using uh, British Airways uh, flight 365. So the all sign will be Speedbird 365 Heavy. So aircraft will be uh, 787. Dreamliner Echo Golf Charlie Charlie to Echo Mike. And alternate is Echo Bravo. Uh, cruise level will be 310. And date is a bit dated. Okay. Top fuels, take off weight, and everything. Okay, so this is the routing using uh, Sonex. Um, ID and the star will be Lamso or Lamsa 2A. Sony, so the this SID will be Sony, uh, Sony One Yankee, uh, and then Lams Alpha. Okay, so that is the star. This is ID, and here's the flight plan in Tim Brief. Okay, so this is the data. That we're gonna use okay so let's open the navigraph. graph so here i've already prepared the uh, imported the uh, the flight plan into navigraph. graph so similar flight plan and thing for the pro like ls seven yeah. only thing that's left okay uh it everything will be uh, already set up and also the charts we're going to do some briefing later on uh, so this is airport on manchester so we're going to use uh, two three left this is the data uh, the runway is quite long so give okay it and we'll probably park around pier c okay and then uh, what else thing uh this is the departures we're gonna do uh, 5000 limits here the limitation here constraints so we have to meet the 5000 uh, after wall we're gonna be able to go to our sign out yes this is a altitude constraint and of course the speed constraints applies which is below 10 maximum to 150 okay uh, that is the SID and of course the star will probably coming from Lamso here at POS uh, Maximum flat level 250 flat level 70. So this one is uh, At this zoo goal, we have to arrive around 10,000 feet between this uh, uh, Altitude train, okay, and also uh, 250 As stated below 10,000 Okay, so that is the constraint, and I think we're gonna do some kind of turn, turning here, down leg to capture the ILS. Uh, that's the only constraint. ILS is to seven, uh, and EHAM. I think but we haven't we haven't really opened EHAM airport already. Oh, so why it doesn't okay already here 
airport here, Liham 27 is here, so 11,000 feet, 3.4 kilometer uh, length of. Okay, so we're gonna circle here and then try to land. So that is our flight plan uh, in Navigraph. So it's been uh, loaded in Navigraph. Okay, and now we go to pilot to ATC. So I have uh, created a flight plan here, but if you haven't, then you have to waypoint and then put C or Echo Golf Charlie Charlie and then Echo Hotel Alpha Mike nations and then populate that with the waypoint from the Navigraph that we have created. Okay, so then you create you get a full flight plan including the altitudes and everything just to save the time oh, load it it will load so this is the latest versions from pilot to ATC okay take some time okay so this is already populated so it's going to be very similar except for this one a bit different here kind of graphical tension of it but uh, I've checked this one is identical so the flight level 310 round Lamix here and then I think top of this sand will be a then very I think I've seen it before but not sure anyway you'd be top of this sand somewhere you cannot find it anyway there will be some top of this sand or thing around here with the lamp so here yeah be some top of this uh so yeah it hasn't been uh it should be validated first and then once validated we're gonna file it and then we can try to request the ifr and to it is okay so i'm using uh several uh sound here if you so some youtubers very good one i probably try to link below so i'm using additional voices from microsoft by downloading the language pack uh, but I think when you up uh, when the Windows is getting update, it's always getting overridden. So you have to do another upload and uh, sorry, do another setting because it's going to be lost again when the Windows is uh, updated, updating the system. Okay, so the, yeah, unfortunate. You have to and using the rack edit uh, kind of patch run. To, to set up this voice again okay so that's the only caveat i'm using also the button control for ptt so i'm going to use uh, uh, speech recognition also uh, at this flight uh, so i'm going to talk to atc and towers and ground to instead of my co-pilot because uh, obviously jenny okay so let's do it okay once you've done it uh, then you can export it into uh, FS2020 if you want to but we're going to do manual programming uh, I'm going to show you manual programming because you're not depending on to uh, FS2020 ATC anymore we're going to do manual programming inside the FMC of uh, the 787 okay so that, and I've tested it's working fine uh, with a small trick that to ensure that the Autopilot will lock into the program. Okay, so let's go inside the aircraft. So we're gonna do a full flight again, but you're gonna see uh, how do I pro. Okay, see you in the cockpit. Okay, sorry. Before we go to the cockpit, one more thing. Uh, before I forgot, uh, because we're gonna use Pilot to ATC, you you don't need to create the whole flight plan here. So you just need to set up here the uh, departure airport 
Manchester and we're gonna select here let's do uh, I think here is the the big airplane here so set as departure here and that's it you don't need to fill up anything else okay so just leave it here blank and even here is okay nothing just the time set the time accordingly and let start with 7 in the morning a.m okay so it will be early morning flight it's going to be raining will be thing to runway to three left here and then we'll go back to east okay uh so that's it so let's see you in let me uh, let's meet in the still very early morning so we are uh, at Manchester right now and we are using uh, the add-on of course for Maco uh, sim okay so it's a very nice add-on for this uh, Manchester Airport okay Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, ladies. Have a safe flight. Hi, Cap. The aircraft has been refueled. She is ready for you. Thank you. Okay, we are inside the coffee at uh, Jenny. Our first of the high morning, Jenny. Good morning, Cap. Okay, so. The aircraft. Okay. I'm fine, thank you. Setting up. Okay. Everything seems to be in order. <laughs> Off. Down. Here down. Here. And let's do IRS alignment and T auto F on Our passengers we can set to on the upper console are ready everything okay okay seems to be good let me connect the pilot to ATC first because it takes some time to connect. I guess it's really on board. Yep, so that's connected. Oops. Uh, simulator disconnected. Okay, good. Green lights on the pilot to ATC, so it's connected now, ready to. Uh, we can also try to listen at this frequency you want to oops sorry one two one the uh point in line seven here hey quite the One, I'm, I'm using the keypad from the the sim. 
case transfer transfer seems to be uh, onto here anyways also at this is functioning here I think I've not setting up the this so let let us get uh, get it later uh, we can use also the simple mirror just to get the address uh, for our uh, alti altimeters okay so I think we're done with the reply loop I'm going out for walk around inspection okay see you around so let's do the programming because we're going to request the uh, IFR flight planning to ATC or we can actually file for it. let me validate first in pilot to ATC so it's green light so it's already validated we already get the correct one and then we file so we send first um, how to do it I think I show you in another video I'm not gonna talk about it at this video so I'm filing it not right now in process into ATC from the pilot to ATC okay good it's green so it's filed already so it's already got a clearance uh, act already received actually uh, from uh, from by the ATC so we could be we can now proceed in programming it let's put ATC so we're gonna do manual so it takes some time so it I think we are on a I've got I forgot which gate I think 2-9 uh, and then let's here break route uh, we're gonna do a of Charlie Charlie runway to three left okay and then destination is M echo Mike Okay, flight number uh, uh, 365. This is, has to be manual because we don't, don't we do we do not download it from Timbre or whatever. So before that, we're gonna set departure first. Uh, we're gonna depart from three left, okay, and then Tony, Tony one Yankee, it, and then oops more we're gonna try to arrive this is our plan i hope they give us what we plan but can change the so lamb lambs to alpha and we're gonna do sugol uh missions okay okay good so that's set the sid and star and we go back to route uh, and then go to next page and then we start to enter the uh, the waypoint manually. So after, because I already take a note after uh, our departure from, uh, you see here uh, we already populate here from. So we just need to uh, start from Sonex our transition from the SID and until Lamso. So Lamso already populated, so you don't have to enter Lamso. Okay, so we just start from Sonic. So if you take a look into your Navigraph or uh, Pilot to ATC, uh, you can find the, the waypoint. Okay, so after Sonic, we have to desic. If you want to see uh, here, if you want to see it uh, here, after Sonic is desic and then. Uh, until here Bukut so we have to put desic to Bukut each of this waypoint okay manually so let's put uh, desic and put it here into the uh, before Sogol so if you want to put it here it will be between this but if we want to be for Sugol uh, then you have to put it here the so Sugol will be put down or pushed down and then L not L not is waypoint 
then put it here again because it will push down Sugo and put it in between the sick and Sugo and then Mamu again here and then Eduxo here and Lamix our uh, top of climb here continue to next page and then F cow here again and then rogue up it here again and I'm fell here again and dollars here again and top of descent uh, and don't need to put it in next is any two put it here again next uh, D ball it here again and book with but this is the last one waypoint on end route waypoint okay we put it here again so we have if you see here uh, from desic here or actually after after sonic here you can see desic is after sonics uh, here or the uh the sick and l not Mamul, Eduxo, Lamix, and then Esp uh, Fkal, Rogag, Anfield, Dolas, and Enito. Uh, top of this end, you don't need to put it in. Dibal, uh, Dibal, and after that, Bukut. After Bukut, it will go into uh, the star. And then this one is actually the approach black. Okay, so I think we've done the program. You can check here in the leg. So this one is and this one is the SID uh, waypoint already populated automatically. The uh, pre-program uh, SID standard in, uh, instrument departures, and then after this you go to desic. So we can delete this route discontinuity will be connected so next to the sick L not Mamul Aduxolamix F Cal Rogak Ampel Dolas any Adival book Lamso okay so from Bukut entering star Lamso here is a star we are still not correct I think right level uh yeah I think this at post is uh, yeah it could be correct though because we are declined uh, descending from two uh three one zero uh, within Lamso and then you go uh, further down into 7,000 here uh, between 7,000 and 10,000 you have to be, you get to between this uh, it should constrain here uh, to go uh, yeah so you have to calculate if you have time to send uh, this at this distance okay and then after Sugo it will goes into uh, as, uh, the approach track so we can delete this continuity just to tidy up so SPL uh, so this one is the uh, I think ILS um, setting so we might change this one if we get some different runway at this moment we are programming this okay so runway to seven okay so that's it so to activate it you have to click this one uh, to make it uh, working Activate then this one is lighted green you either click here or click here is okay Execute so that is been uh, programmed into FMC and one more thing that I found uh, Very important is you have to select this one or this one or this one actually uh, Like this you click this one so it put in the scratch pad and you click this one again it will create a green so you can see there's a, if you don't do that the the autopilot line is not 
appear in the display. So to, to make it appear, you click that one and click again and then exit. So that will be from Stian to Magenta line here. So it means that the, the program has been activated. Here. And the line is appearing in the navigational display. If not, if you don't do that, like selecting this one and then from scratch pad and back here again, it doesn't show this line, the Magenta line. It will follow, but I don't think it shows. It said that's the only trick that work at this moment. It might change later on when they fix it, but yeah, so that's the only one. Okay, so I think at this moment we can try to request a DC first. Uh, let's try the frequency uh, clearance is one to one. This seven. Let's, uh, okay. Let's record for clearance. So I'm using ATC chatter also. Okay, let's do, uh, Speedbird 365 Heavy, uh, ready to copy IFR clearance. Speedbird 365 Heavy is cleared to Echo Hotel Alpha Ike. Climb via the Zone 1 by departure with this next transition, then as filed. Expect departure runway 23 left. Climb to flight level 120 via the departure. Expect higher clearances 7 minutes after departure. Squawk 3603. Another plastic for the one-to-one. -one. Speedbird 365 Heavy, clear to Echo Hotel Alpha Mike. Climb to 120. Walk 3603. Three. Three Speedbird 365 Heavy, clear to Echo Hotel Alpha Mike. Okay, I think we have to repeat again. Speedbird 365 Heavy requests uh, ready to copy IFR clearance. Uh, Speedbird 365 Heavy ready to copy IFR clearance. Speedbird 365 Heavy is clear to Echo Hotel Alpha Mike. Climb via the zone one wide departure with this next transition, then as filed. Expect departure runway 23 left. Climb to flight level 120 via the departure. Expect higher clearances 7 minutes after departure. Squawk 3603. Delta 53. Uh, Speedbird 365 Heavy, clear to Echo Hotel Alpha Mike. Climb to flight level 120, squawk 3603. Three. Oh my Speaker god. Speedbird 365 <laughs> heavy, clear to Echo Hotel Alpha Mike. Come on. Speedbird 365 heavy, cleared to Echo Hotel Alpha Mike. Climbing to flight level 120, squawk 3603. Three. Three back correct. 365 heavy clear to Echo Hotel Alpha Mike. Uh, Speedbird 365 heavy clear to Echo Delta Mike. Climbing to flight level 120, Squawk 3603. Hello, we're back in Speedbird 365 heavy clear to Echo Hotel Alpha Mike. Hello, one, two, six, four. One, two, one, nine, two, five, two, one, two, Speedbird 365 Heavy, cleared to Echo Hotel Alpha Mike, climbing to flight level 120, squawk 3603. Speedbird 365 Heavy, 
cleared to echo Hotel Alpha Mike. Climbing to flight level 120, walk 3603. Speedbird 365 Heavy Relax Correct. QNH is 1013, let us know when you're ready for pushback. Okay, so we got clearance uh, and then the QNH is 1013. Uh, sorry, it's a bit slow because kind of uh, one zero one three. Correct, I think. It's, I think. Standard, I guess. The rain is a bit. Uh, been less raining right now. Okay. Think she's back now. I'm back. No issues found during walk around inspection. Okay, good, Jenny. Uh, so we we'll just continue uh, to three. I think it will be to three. Set to three two. Okay. Um, two three two. Okay, uh, uh, this one is two fifty. I think we are okay. Do to Uh, that's it. I think setting up correct. Hi, here are some water bottles for you. The security and safety check are complete. Are we okay to start boarding? Yes, you can start boarding. Thanks. Clear to board. So we continue the setting right now. Welcome aboard. Welcome aboard. Uh, Welcome aboard. Fuel quantity. I think we can continue the setting up. So now we are doing the payload. Uh, let's see in the sim brief. Uh, the fuel will be 11.6. I know it's supposed to be refuel first before boarding the passengers, but it'll be okay. Okay. Our takeoff uh, weight will be 186. Okay. Cool. So now it's correct here. The cruise altitude is 310. And cost index is 93. Oh, sorry. Let's see. This one, let's say 35 degrees Celsius. Takeoff is let's do for like uh, flat five. D1, 135, 150, 160. Wow, that's very high speed. Take off. Okay, so I think that's it. Uh, we can set the ILS later on. Uh, when we are start uh, approaching uh, the runway, okay. Uh, 
I think that's it. So we can put it that uh, still on. Uh, we can put here on. Uh, okay. This one RTO. Give me an answer. Thank you. Uh, I don't know why this doesn't uh, reflect. Uh, something is wrong here. Doesn't change. So oh, okay. So I I didn't change. So it's one to one. Okay. Be on beacon and stroke. Let's put it on. Let me APU, let's start it. So it's in uh, APU is starting. Let's do a uh, pre flight checklist oxygen. Oxygen. Tested 100%. Flight instruments. Heading to 32. Uh, altitude meter is set. 1013. Uh, Parking brakes. Set. Fuel control switches. Cut off. Pre flight checklist completed. Can you give me an so how's the boarding process? We almost complete. Okay. Hi guys, here's the load sheet for you. Okay, thank you. No problem. Have a safe flight. We have completed the boarding process. Okay, you can close the door. Cabin crew, arm doors and cross check. Doors armed and cross check. Okay, so I think we need to uh, fly back to ground. Go ahead, fly tech. We'll be ready shortly. Okay, I uh, will hold. Okay, so I think it's going to close the door. Uh, roll it engine, everything's set here. Parking brake to RTO. Fuel quantity check, APU on. Okay, so we are actually okay. So let's do before start checklist. Flight deck door. Okay, uh, uh, not yet. Okay, so thing. Close and lock. Passenger sign. Uh, auto. MCP. MCP. Let's see, uh, 250 speed uh, heading to 32 altitude 5000 set takeoff speeds uh, v1135 vr 150 uh, v2 160 cd pre-flight completed trim 008.5 set taxi and takeoff briefing completed beacon on before start checklist completed. Okay, cool. Uh, flight tech to ground. Go ahead, flight tech. We are ready uh, for push back and engine start. Release the parking brakes, please. Okay. So let's uh, request to ground clearance first. 
Speedbird 365 Heavy are ready for pushback and engine start. Speedbird 365 Heavy pushback and engine start approved. Parking brake release. Roger. gentlemen, on behalf of Captain and the entire crew, we would like to welcome you aboard this flight. My name is Linda, and I'm your chief flight attendant. Our flight time today will be as planned. At this time, make sure your seat backs and tray tables are in their full upright position. Also make sure your seat belt is correctly fastened. Thank you. at your discretion. Okay. Good. Got the right engine first. Okay, N2 rising, EGT rising, N1. Everything left, okay. Oh, I forgot to put the uh, uh, three six zero three. Quad three six zero B. And they're up. Delta 136. Hi. Okay, so. Second engine. And to rising. E rising. Wait a minute. Not rising. GT is not rising here, but this one is rising. Okay, it is. Okay, cool. So it's a cloudy morning. I think we are not pushed back. And trying to do this. See, I think we can take a look at here. Maybe going that way. So we're kind of trying to add to that area. Okay. Seems to be okay. This one okay. 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 PHF, that's a PHF. Down 
think engine is already gone. I can switch off the APU now. So I think we can stop right now. Push back complete and set parking brakes, please. Parking brake set. Roger. Okay, the tow bar. Okay, the tow bar is disconnected and the equipment is clear. We will see you on the left side with the pin. Okay, you can go to hand signals. Thank you. Thanks. Have a good flight. See you later. Okay. The hand signal received. So we are clear and uh, let's prepare for taxi. So... Flight control. Pull down, pull up, pull left, pull right, brother pull left, brother pull right. Okay, good. Okay, control check. Uh, parking set, taxi light on. Yes, instrument display check, TCAS to Terra, I think it's sorry, oh, TCAS is that yet? There is Terra, active, uh, flight control check done. Okay, let's do before taxi checklist. Anti-ice. Auto. Recall. Uh, check. Auto brake. RTO. Ground equipment. Uh, clear. Flight controls. Uh, check. Before taxi checklist completed. Okay, let's request uh, taxi clearance. Uh, Speedbird 365 Heavy, uh, request taxi to runway 23 left. Speedbird 365 Heavy, request taxi to runway uh, 23 left. Speedbird 365 Heavy, taxi to runway 23 left via taxiways Alpha, Charlie, Bravo, Beta, hold short runway 23 left. Okay. I got clearance already, so let's taxi. Flight director on, parking brake off. Okay to taxi. Okay to taxi. Okay. Clear left side. Clear right side. Reiner 5, Hotel Victor, taxi, Hotel 1, left turn, enter runway 16, pull short runway 2. Here. Gonna turn to the right over there. Any day. Okay, hotel three, hotel room three four. Come on, one five. Come on, one five. Remember, continue taxi. Cross room three four. Hotel one, link four, April four, stand three one two. Cross room six three four. Hotel one, link four, April four, stand three one two. Come on, okay, one five. Seven. Gonna turn right in front of us, then yeah, turn left. Flight 
Wire 9 Kilo Juliet, I have trust park behind your contract. Uh, Roger, fine, I could. Clear left side. Clear right side. Oh, it's getting heavy, the rain. And that's uh, our holding point over there before crossing runway 2, 3 right. So we're gonna request some clearance. Speedbird 365 Heavy, ready to cross runway 23 right. Speedbird 365 Heavy, clear to cross runway 23 right. This is much more comprehensive, much better than the ATC from FS2020. So you, uh, you can try to follow certain rules here rather than the default one. Clear left side. Clear right side. Cross is runway 23 right. And make ourselves to the left. Gonna take the longest route. That it later on. Tight turn over here. One one eight point six two. One one eight point six two. Speaker three six five heavy contact tower one one one. Okay. circle here and that is our holding point over there kind of very tight turn I don't know it's a, supposed to be like this huh? but yeah I think it's for smaller plane is okay okay let's uh, let's stop here before we enter runway so let's put the big lights on Okay, it's okay. Okay, I think uh, 118625. Um, uh, Speedbird 365 Heavy, ready for departure runway 23 left. Okay, we got clearance already. Uh, 
Cabin crew prepare for takeoff. Okay, take off flap. I have to set the flap though. Forget about it. Okay. Did break off. Before take off checklist. Flap. Five degrees set. Before takeoff checklist completed. Enter runway. Enter runway to three left. Confirmed. The left side. Clear right side. Okay, we are lining up into runway. Okay, so stop here. Setting up. Ready for takeoff? Ready for takeoff. Takeoff. The bang angle would not be too high. Okay, we try to turn to the right. Speedbird 365 Heavy Contact Manchester Radar Director on 121.35. Enjoy your morning. Okay, 121.35. One, Speedbird 365 Heavy uh, Climbing to 5000. Speedbird 365 Heavy, good morning. Radar Contact. So we got radar contact already, and we're still going to go to 5,000 here and turning right. And I think we're gonna pass uh, Whiskey Alpha Lima, and then go. We can go above 5,000 feet. So now we are restricted to 5,000 feet and 250, of course. Okay, uh, flap up. Sorry. After takeoff checklist, landing gear up, flaps up. After takeoff checklist completed, okay, we're turning right. So it's work uh, seamlessly right now, the autopilot. It's very cloudy outside. Anything? Here we are. Here we are a bit above the lower level cloud here. It's still quite tight. 
It, it, this is uh, Whiskey Alpha Lima 3-3, so once we pass that, then we can climb to 9 one, two, zero. Okay, so we better arm 1 to 0. Then once it passes, we can try to execute that. Very nice. Opening over there in the cloud. Uh, 